Okay, I loose up the uh, bracket in the back that's attached to the knuckle. And remove the caliper. Okay, so let's get the push right out. Okay, okay the knuckle is removed. Uh, the first thing that has to come out is the hub, and then the dust plate, and then the bearing. Okay, to remove the hub, it's got to be pushed out. Let's see if this works. Those three bolts here for the bearing have to come out. Yeah, breaker bar works. Separating, so just have to keep that. Okay. Okay. So to insert a bearing, I sit here on the table like that. Put my knuckle on top. Line the holes. Insert my bolt. tie those three nicely evenly until this is pressed in right in okay so the hub is ready and to seize grease actually, both side actually there you go and this uh, helps it from uh, from getting stuck Okay, so it's in now. It's pressed in, went out smooth. And I did put here the old uh, bearing run. That's to prevent the, uh, the bearing run from being pushed out. 
so it just blocks it with this piece on top here so this just stop the uh, the bearing run inside to to pop out all right so again I use the old bushing for that helps to center it and just like a I think it's a 10 inch or 12 inch uh, half inch bolt and here it is nice and smooth no damage makes it makes it easier to start from the top just keep everything loose for now Okay, so the parking brakes are on. Caliper disc goes back on. Okay, the next step is the uh, caliper. to get this bracket here back in there and my two bolts here and the next step will be your wheel and you're good to go